Hello everyone, welcome to Let's Speak Chinese. I'm your host Maureen Akinyi. Now, I hope you have a paper and a pen because we are here for you. This is a program that is going to teach you Chinese language and its culture. Now, do you know over 1 billion people speak Chinese language as a native language? Do you want to be among the 1 billion people? Join us as we are going to take you through the basics of Chinese language. I'm not alone in the studio. I'm joined by the teacher and the two students. Hello, teacher. Hi, hello. Hello. Hello, students. Hello. How are you? Fine. I'm fine. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Okay, teacher. Tell us your name. Yeah, my name is uh, Otieno Onyango. And I'm glad to be here so that we can learn Chinese together. I hope you? the students are also willing to learn. Yeah, yeah. very okay. much. Uh, my name is Alice Jambi, and I'm really happy to be here. Can I to learn Chinese? Uh, my name is Arumidi St. Paspas. I'm happy to be here to learn Chinese together with you. In, in, in Chinese, you greet very simply, hmm? almost like in Swahili. I'll teach you that so that you can, then you can, you can go to the next uh, thing that probably you're going to, to learn today. Okay, And Tell that us is Ni uh, Hao. Yeah. Okay, so when I tell you ni hao, mm -hmm. you reply back, you say ni hao. Let's try that. Ni hao. Ni hao. Yeah. And then uh, ni will mean you, hao means good. Mm, so ni hao. You're good. In Chinese, you're telling somebody you're good. Ah. Yeah, so ni hao. Ni hao. Ni hao, Alice. Ni hao. Yeah, simple like that, eh? Yeah. Uh, so I'm, I'm thinking today probably you can learn... Uh, Oh, before we learn that, I wanted to say, in the, the language itself, in, in Chinese, okay, in English you say Chinese, but the language itself in Chinese you say Han Yu, okay? Han. 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 Yu. Yu. Okay. Yes. Yeah, can you repeat Han. that? That is yeah. Han. 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 Yu. Han. Yeah, I forgot Han. you said Han Yu. Han Yu. Listen, try that. I can't repeat it. <laughs> <laughs> it is a H-A-N. And then why you? Han, you. Han, you. Yeah, Han, that is Chinese Han, in Chinese. Yeah. Yeah. Han are the majority in, uh, in China, the majority ethnic group in China. And then you mm. simply means a Chinese uh, word for a spoken language. Mm. Okay? Mm. So if it's Kiswahili, I'll say, Swahili, you. Yeah, like that. So you means a spoken language. Swahili. Yes. Then you add you. Okay? So silly. Yeah. Yeah. So silly. Yeah. yeah. So we, we may have that problem of, of pronouncing them at, 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 at first. Mm -hmm. Maybe because we don't know how to pronounce the word. So maybe you can take that lesson and then see if, if we can be able to, to pronounce it better after we've looked at the pronunciation. Okay. What do you think? Yeah. yeah. So what do you have for us today? Yeah, the pronunciation. I think the best point to start is the pronunciation. Pronun I'll say this first, yeah? The, in pronunciation, you'll want to consider three things, okay? Mm. You'll consider your initial sound, yeah? The way you articulate the initial sound. And then you combine that with your final sound. So then now you have a syllable. Mm. And then Chinese is a tonal language, okay? Mm. You've heard when I said that uh, in Chinese you greet ni hao. It's a certain rhythm, eh? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, so that's the tone. That is what helps you to give out your meaning, okay? We'll learn about it later on, okay? Mm. So the third element is going to be now the tones, okay? The tones, eh? ni hao, like that, okay? So it helps us. So in those three, we'll start with the initials, okay? Those beginning sounds, okay? For example, a sound like B. Yeah? In English, you'll say B, okay? But in Chinese, a B, you pronounce it in this manner. And I'd like you to repeat after me, okay? So B, you say bua, bua, mm, very bua, bua, yeah, like that. Mm? Alice, yeah? <laughs> how do you find it? <laughs> I'm busy. Yeah. 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 A is the sound there, okay? And then P, almost the same as uh, as B, but now you know you hold it a bit longer. So pua, pua, yeah, that's a P. Pua, pua. So bua and pua. Yeah. Poor. Yeah, you need to differentiate those two, eh? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there are some communities in our culture they can't differentiate between a B and a P. 
<laughs> you want to get that right, okay? Yeah. And then M, M you'll say more. 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 So now we have bo, puo, and more. Mm -hmm. Can you repeat it like that? Bo, puo, and more. F, you'll say fuo. Fuo. Yeah, fuo. Fuo. Mm, the lip touches the, the upper teeth, yeah? Mm. Fuo, like that. Fuo. Yeah. How so many are they? Those are four already now, the four initial mm. sounds, okay, that you pronounce in Chinese, in Hanyu, okay? Mm. So we'll start just again and see, okay? Uh, but in total, mm. there are about mm. 23 initials, okay? There mm. are 21 that you actually uh, pronounce as consonants, mm. and then with the addition of Y and W, which sound more like a vowel, but they mark yeah. the beginning of a word. So we need to have them also as the consonants, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, uh, we'll say Buo. Puo, mo, and fuo. Okay? Mm. The other sounds will include a D. So D, say after me. D. 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 Yeah, that tongue. D. 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 And then T now, hold it. D. T. D. T. T. Yeah, like for example, when somebody asks you, Ni hao ma? Yeah? That means, how are you? And then somebody says, Tai hao. Very fine. Eh? T. Tai hao. Okay. Tai hao. Maybe I can try that. Mm. I greet, I mm. say ni hao ma. Mm -hmm. And then you respond, you know, you're feeling superb that day, eh? So you tell me tai hao. Let me try, let me try and say, eh? Mm -hmm. uh, try. Try with me. Ni hao ma. Tai hao. Mm. <laughs> ni hao ma. Okay. Tai hao. Uh -huh. Yeah, yep. so du. And then tu. And then now mm. n. You say no, no, yeah, no, no. As in, for example, the greeting we had initially, ni, ni, hao, no, ni, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then now, uh, now you have bo, po, mo, fo, du, tu, no, le. Mm -hmm. But I'd like you to repeat after me the, the D to the L part, okay? Mm -hmm. So just say after me, du. Yeah, how do you think about it so far? Not very hard to articulate, right? <laughs> it's not very. <laughs> you know, Teacher Nyango, yeah. you have done, uh, you, seem, you, seem, you seem very good at Chinese language. How long oh, have you okay. done it? Uh, in class, properly in class, mm. for about three and a half years. Mm. Yeah. But uh, I've been teaching, so. Maybe that's where now I get my experience from. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Let's continue. Yeah, we can continue now. Mm. Uh, the others that you're going to hear how they sound are Z, C, and S. So how do you say Z in Chinese? Z. 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 C. S. S. Yeah, like um, one cut in English, you say a cut. Many cuts, you say cuts. Mm -hmm. So that ending pronunciation, T S pronunciation, mm -hmm. is the C. Also, I would pronounce the C in Chinese. Mm -hmm. So you say C, and then S, you'll say S. Mm, very smooth, like that. S. Yeah, you say Z, uh -huh. Z, yeah. then C, S, 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 Like a dictionary mm -hmm. in Chinese, you say S D N. Mm. Food. Mm -hmm. You say tsai. Tsai. C A I. Spelling. Oh, C -A -I. And tsai. Tsai. You don't say tsai. like the hard, you know, you don't say kai. Mm. Okay? There's no that uh, friction. Mm. You simply say tsai. So, teacher, you want to mean that there is no ignoring of tones? No, you cannot. You oh. mean something different. Mm -hmm. It has to be the precise tone. Uh, <laughs> and so then, uh, yeah, and then S, mm -hmm. S you'll say S. S. Yeah, the C and the S. 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 And the, S. Uh, yeah? the C and the S. The C, yeah, that uh, you differentiate, you yeah. hold in the air. Mm. S, that's a C. Uh, then uh, you let out the air freely. S. Uh, okay? So. Like number four. Mm. S. In Chinese, you say S for four. Oh. Su, su. Eh, su. 
Su. Su. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Now the hardest pronunciation, in my opinion, would be the following. But we'll try and make it very easy. Okay. Z H. Z H. That one we do not have it in English. We don't have it in Swahili. Mm. So how do you pronounce Z H? How would you pronounce Z H? Z H. If I give you this this spelling, Z H E, how would you pronounce it? <laughs> Z-H-Y or something. Yeah. So what you do, Z-H, you'll say, you'll roll, you curl your tongue back to the roof of your mouth, at the back there, uh, like that. Uh. And then from there, you try to now release the air. I told you it's the hardest. But with practice, you find that it's very easy, okay? Like country, the country China, in Chinese, you'll call it Chungwa, that initial ZH pronunciation forms the spelling of the initial uh, ZHOND for the spelling for the country China. Okay? Mm. Uh -huh. So I say Chungwa. Chungwa. Yeah. Most people don't get it at mm. first because, you know, we are used to the CH pronunciation. That's the closest mm. that we can, you know, mm. uh, relate to that one. Okay? Mm -hmm. But the idea is curl back your tongue and then dr, dr, dr. Okay? Yeah. Dr, so, and then C H. Uh -huh. Ch. When curling your tongue. Yeah, while curling your tongue still. Ch. 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 Let them. Let them try. Ch. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is that okay? Ch. 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 Then. To differentiate mm. now with that, yeah. I mean the ZH, the CH, and the SH, mm -hmm. while still curling your tongue, okay, you pronounce the SH as sh, 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 sh. Mm, like you are saying, she is, but with your tongue sh. curled, yeah, oh. sh, she sh. is, sh. Sh. Yeah, so sh, sh. Sh. sh, yeah, so j, ch. Sh, Z H, C H, and S H. Hmm. Like if I ask you, Ni Shi 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 Shi, who are you? Ni Shi Shi. Yeah. Who are you? I could ask Ni Shi Shi or no. Ask me that. Ask me that. You just try. Ah, I like that pronunciation. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> and then I tell you, wa or tieno. Wa tieno. Yeah, so that S H pronunciation. What do you think that means? Ni shi shi. It actually means who are you? Oh. Yeah, oh, and then yeah. I'm telling you, I am mm. or tieno. Mm. Okay, so shi. Then R, in Chinese the R, okay, does not have that, you know, uh, rapid uh, friction, eh? Yeah. You say it very lightly. <coughs> Your tongue is still curled. Don't, <coughs> don't forget that, eh? Yeah. <coughs> a Chinese person, you'll call a Chinese person, Chungguo. <coughs> Chungguo. <coughs> ren. Ren. Now, Ren means a person. Okay? Ren. Chungguo yes. means? Chungwo is China. You remember we said Chungwo is China. Oh, so it's like you're saying a Chinese person. Chungwo, mm. China, mm. Ren, a person. Should we look at the other one? Ah, we should repeat first. <laughs> 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 yes, we can yeah. repeat that. Mm. We'll repeat from the top, okay? Yeah. So B. Buo. Buo. Puo. Puo. Muo. Muo. Fuo. Fuo. Du, du, tu, tu, nu, nu, lu, lu, zu, zu, su, su. Let me ask. Su is which letter? Su, C. Yes, C. Okay. And then su, su. Yeah, for S. And then ju, ju, Z H. Yeah. Sh, sh, C H, sh, 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 S H, and then R, R, R. Yeah. Then we are ready to look at the other one. I think the other ones that you're going to look at is the pronunciation of J, Q, 
and X. J, Q, and X. So for J, the same way you pronounce it in Swahili. G, G like um, like G Kony. G that G. G. Yeah. So just say that for me. G. G. Now Q is a bit different. Okay. Q almost sounds like C H, but this is how you say it. C. C. Your tongue is in front here. Yeah. C. C. Like money. Money in Chinese you say Qian. 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 I like money. Do you like money? Yeah. You don't like money. Who doesn't like money? I like Qian. So T T T Q T. Okay. Then X. You'll say C C C. Like SH, but now with your tongue in front here, okay? Uh, you push it up from the C. C. Yeah, like uh, you remember when you were greeting. Mm -hmm. I said uh, I can greet you sometimes, you know, by asking you, you say, Ni hao ma. Right? Mm -hmm. And then you say, you'll reply and say, Wo hao. Mm -hmm. And then you want mm -hmm. to also be polite, mm -hmm. okay? And modest. Mm -hmm. Then you tell me, Wo hao xie xie. Wow, wow. Yes, yes. Uh, I'm fine. What thank do you think CSA means? Yes. Thank you. Ah, so you've been <laughs> learning. Eh? So CSA means thank you. That X is, mm. you know, in that spelling. So CSA. C. -A -C -A. Okay. Mm. Uh, so J. G. G. T. T. C. C. Okay. C. Yes. And then very quickly uh -huh. as we finish. The remaining is G, K, and H. So, G, G, K, K, and H. H. Yeah, and then, of course, Y and W. E and O. E and O. Yes. E, O. And that's how you pronounce. Conclude for us. Yeah, so, uh, I've said that to know how to pronounce the word, you need to remember these three things, okay? The initials, what we just did. Mm -hmm. The finals, what we'll do next. And then the sounds the tones okay you get those on rice communication how the initials poor poor more four the two No, no, go, 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 Okay, how do you say goodbye in Chinese? Yeah, very easy. Hmm. So we say it eh, together. Zai. Zai. Jian. Jian. Zai Jian. Zai Jian. Yes. Okay, viewer, that was a great show for today. Hope to see you next time. Same place. Zai Jian. Zai Jian.